The turnaround of things is dependent on the financial ability of the Ministry of Youth and Sports to support that. And the Minister, Mustafa Usif, he has revealed that his office has made more than $2 million in its initiative to generate $25 million for the Black Stars' participation in the FIFA World Cup and for the development of other sporting disciplines in the country. However, he says the target is still below what they desire. We've made more than $2 million now, and we are still uh, appealing to corporate institutions to support us. These successes that we are talking about today do not come just by accident. It came by investment. Because the last time Commonwealth Games went, only 78 athletes qualified. This time, we are talking over 100. So it means we give opportunity to more athletes to go for qualifications, yeah. and they've qualified. They prepared they have more preparation time to be able to prepare to go. So there's huge investment going to it, even the now football sporting discipline. But we can only do that by co with corporate Ghana supporting us and corporate institutions supporting us and individual philanthropists supporting us. Recently, when we played in Abuja, Dangote <laughs> supported the Nigerian Football Fed uh, Federation and the Sports Ministry to renovate a stadium, an individual. So. You can imagine, we have similar rich men here in Ghana. We are calling on them to support us so that we can position our sports, sports sector as well. 